Joe Beermaster here. We have a 2001 Ford Ranger and this actually covers multiple years of the older style Ranger. And it may even be the same for the new style. I'll show you where the fuse box locations are. So this is simple. There's two. We're going to open the driver's door. And if you look on the left side of the dash here, see this little compartment. It does say fuses. I'll just pull that out. And there is your first fuse box location. And there is not a template underneath the lid. A lot of them have it, so you're going to have to refer to your owner's manual for that. I'm going to show you where the OBD2 hookup is before I show you the next fuse box. It's right here under the steering wheel. Directly under the steering wheel right there. So you need to hook up. That's where that is. And the second fuse box is located under the hood on the driver's side right here in this box. You can see it right here in the corner. It does say fuses, fuse compartment port. So we're going to open that up. And you can see a little template underneath. It doesn't tell you what the fuses are for, but it does give you the number. There's a relay center and power center there. So that's the secondary engine compartment fuse box. It's a little tough to get in there, but we're going to get that in. So that's where they're located. You need to refer to the owner's manual on this. On the newer models, they kind of put a template under there so you can identify what the fuses are for. So that is your two fuse boxes and the OBD2 computer port hook up for the scanner. And that's it. This is a good looker for a 2001. There's Putty making another appearance in our video. Joe Beermaster, thanks for watching. I hope this does help you and please subscribe.